Mason, you, you won the Chief Award. That's given to the player who works the best with the media. But nobody has ever won that award in their first year with the Steelers. What made that so easy for you, and what does that award mean to you? Yeah, uh, I said this earlier. I think just my time at Michigan um, helped me prepare for situations like this and, and dealing with media. Um, I had some good mentors at Michigan. Um, their PR guy, Dave Avloff, and that really just prepared me for the dealing with the media in the NFL. And um, I was always told to, to be open and, and answer questions and be honest with the media, and that's what I've just tried to do. Um, so it's it's pretty cool. Let's go. Power forward. High energy bigs. Now's the time. Let's go. So you guys on the offensive line, in the first half of the season, the team averaged about 94 rushing yards per game. Since the bye week, it's 146 rushing yards per game. It's a 50-yard difference. What changed at, at the bye? I know you guys were kind of challenged a little bit to you know start setting the tone there, but was it just that, or, or did something start to click? Yeah, I, I think we're just in terms of execution. I think we're just executing better. The plays really haven't changed. We just we're executing our blocks better. Najee and, and Jalen and Benny and all of our backs have been running really, really well. And so hats off to them. But I think we just understood at, at a point in time in the season that we we're going to have to run the ball um, efficiently to, to have a successful offense. And once we started doing that, running the ball well, I, th I think we've seen how explosive and efficient our offense can be and just control games. And I think we've done for the most part, a pretty good job, at least in the second half of the season. And we all know offensive linemen love to run block. Right? Yeah, of course, <laughs> of course. It makes our job easier, but uh, on top of that, it makes rookie quarterbacks' job easier. It opens up our passing game. Um, like I said, it just, as an offense as a whole, it makes us more efficient um, across the board. You guys have all stayed healthy for the most part. How much does that help with the continuity of everything? It's huge. I think the big part about offense line is, is getting reps together, especially when you got two new guys in there, me and James, that haven't been in the system, haven't been around these guys before this year, just stacking reps all the way from OTAs to training camp to preseason, and then as the season's gone on. And I think we've seen that just getting better, continually getting better each week, being more efficient in the run game, and just being better. Like I said, the, the plays haven't changed, it's just we're executing them better. You mentioned uh, the running of, of your backs. Taking on a couple guys says, no, you're not bringing me down. Warren plows into the end zone for his first rushing touchdown in a black and gold uniform. Kenny Pickett has also added a little bit to that as well with, with his movement. Is there a difference in, in when you're blocking for a young quarterback like that as opposed to an older quarterback and, or a mobile quarterback like that? You had one in Kyler Murray. Uh, when you're in Arizona, I mean, it's, it's a little bit different than just a guy where you know he's going to be in the pocket all the yeah, time. Yeah, I, I think the big thing for us is a mobile quarterback can get us out of a lot of trouble. We're not always perfect up there, and Kenny's done a really good job using his feet and um, making plays when, when protection breaks down or, or things don't go our way. It, it's just part of the game. Adding that, that use of quarterback mobility is huge, and it opens up a lot of our offense. You can extend plays. You can use quarterback mobility situationally, and whether it be runs or short yardage, whatever it might be, it's just been... It has a whole other aspect of, of our offense. Have you seen him grow over the course of the season in terms of his leadership? Yeah, man, Kenny's been awesome. Honestly, his leadership aspect from, from the time he's gotten in the huddle has really controlled the huddle. And for a young quarterback to do that, I think it's pretty special. But they just think about these last two games and these two game-winning drives, pretty, pretty special for a young quarterback to do that. Touchdown, George Jenkins! And the Steelers forge ahead! You know, the Raiders, it was five degrees out. It was, it was windy. We weren't perfect that game, but to go out and get it done when we needed it was huge. And then obviously this past game and with playoff intentions on the line and on the road against a division rival, again, our offense, you know, we're running the ball well, but we weren't getting a lot of points. And when we needed it the most, Kenny got it done. It's pretty cool to be around a special talent like that.